<laughs> boys, we did it. We actually got a lobby together. So Jesse, you have a fresh haircut. Thank you, man. To his, I yeah. don't though. I actually have to go to the barber. But Are you gonna get it cut in uh, Glasgow while you're here? Uh, I'm not so sure about that. A little that. bit risky. A little bit risky. Yeah. Okay, so I gotta make sure uh, I put this in your app. Just like my the barber I go to, uh, safe safe call. She she probably doesn't you know, accidentally just sh sh shave shave me bald. So but no, but what? Nice. What they don't do that in Glasgow either. What I don't know. Maybe about? they accidentally. Uh, whoops! Uh, there he goes. I've I don't know. never I had just, that happen to me. Safe. Actually, there was one time I got a really well, bad haircut in Glasgow, but I don't, I don't think it was people, that reason. So. Uh, but yeah, we've got Fairy Peak Scrub. Um, oh, this is a good one. Yukio. The recent gnarly Seed 1 qualifier, yeah. de defeating GFE, now Dignitas, twice, twice in a row. Twice in a row. That's and not some easy task. And Flame. Oh, and best Flame, RLRS player. The player who the uh, was also known as Flame E by the RLCS casters because the capital E really threw them for a loop. They didn't know what was going on. Good start, though, by Scrub and Very Fairy, good. who I do think will be the favorites in this one. It's a... Uh, Favorable kickoff for them. Right behind Fire Peak. Couldn't catch it. Boom. Goal. So, in twos, what are you looking to do on kickoffs? Because a lot in of people will probably know you were doing uh, rank one climb last season. You got rank one several yeah. times in 2v2. Taking a break, right, break recently, right but you're okay. My best playlist, I think. Um, with kickoffs, 50 50, man. It can go in anyway. If it goes to their side and I can catch it before them, it's good. But sometimes it's, you know. Uh, better for them. I'm going to put the volume up of the game a little bit because this is a little bit quiet in the background. But um, what do you think about the kickoff, the current kickoff meta where everybody's cheating? Cause I think most I, of the time everybody's cheating. Do you yeah, think that's safe? Whenever, do you think that's, long, yeah, that's going to be because, happening for a long time? Honestly, because whenever someone is going for boost at the kickoff, the other team is trying to centerize it. And um, they get a free shot. They simply get a free shot. So what is going on right now <gasps> is, wow. Okay, a little bit lucky for Yukio. Yeah, it's pretty lucky. But yeah, continue. Yeah, Sorry. so right now it's basically two 50-50s most of the time. Seriously, um, uh, the, the yeah, kickoff happens 50-50, then, then two the players cheat 50-50. Do you think, like... Yeah. Otherwise it's... Oh, oh my goodness, very peak. That was a good touch. See, personally, I don't think that that's going to be how kickoffs are done. Like, maybe eight, two years from now when Rocket League's properly evolved. Yeah. Because right now, double 50-50, that doesn't seem like a very safe win condition. Really. I mean... Uh, you can, if you have, uh, for example, if you do have a teammate, you can, you know, uh, consider some other kickoffs. Putting it to one side. Yeah, losing it on purpose. Yeah, it's, it's a very good strategy. No so risk right. at do all. Do you think that the cheat kickoff is just so popular? Because, because you play with randoms. Everybody's you random. Don't, yeah, you yeah. don't know what they do, so yeah, you just true. play it safe. And almost everyone is going for the kick, uh, for the cheat, so you centralize. Yeah. We'll have to wait and see what happens in the NBC 2v2 tournament. That's yeah. going to be a big prize pool. It happened last year. And not going to lie, I didn't really pay attention to it in terms of gameplay. So I don't know what the kickoff meta was. But I wouldn't be surprised if there was less cheating, that's for sure. Mm. Wait and see, though. Yeah, we'll see. As it stands, we're two minutes into game one. Yukio and Scrub winning by a single goal. Don't get confused. This is Batmobile Scrub Kill. I know that most of you guys are expecting Octane Scrub, but he's been playing Batmobile for how long? Maybe a couple months now? A couple months. Sticking with it, apparently. He's sticking with yeah, it he for likes a very it. long time. Yeah. Of course, this is the first year. Scrub just turned 15 just maybe last week, I think it was. So he's, he's now allowed to play RLCS, which is... Maybe one of the reasons why he's switching yeah. to Batmobile. He's trying he's to emulate Cucks and uh, Yeah, a lot of threes. Uh, threes uh, Batmobile is a good three score, sure. It's gonna, if nothing else, I think it's going to make him more thoughtful with what he does on the ball because yeah. Octane, he just kind of goes for it uh, and hopes for the best. But Batmobile, he's a bit more deliberate with his touches. Very good touch there. Heating out very deep. Hey, thanks to 374 Zelda Techie. We got a long uh, message I just to wanted to say that I, Brian, insert last name here, have had a crush on you for about a year or so. Seeing you with that Jesse Bioch makes me jelly. There. Find somebody else to do your alerts. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Jesse a boy, Jesse a boy, Jesse boy. <laughs> Brian, <laughs> please, it's not like that. We're just friends. <laughs> <laughs> We're just friends. It's not like that. <laughs> Oh, I wow, love how you've bypassed the blacklisted word filter with a very <laughs> clever use of B and Och. I do commend that. Yeah. Please never do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Get to blacklist even more words. People keep finding ways to make Brian curse. And all the kids who are watching my stream are just like, Mom, what does this word mean? 
go and say hi to me at an event. And I'm like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I did not mean that at all. Still 1-0. That was kickoff goal, I believe. I was actually looking at my OBS when it happened, but I believe it was a very early goal, if nothing else. It's a, it was a kickoff goal. Yeah. So it was at the start. They're just kind of playing safe. Ferpy got some good chances. Yuki on Scrub have played twos a fair bit in the past, if yeah. I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Scrub, you know, when he's having a bad day of solo twos, he'll just invite someone that he likes playing with. Yuki is one of those yeah. players. Scrub didn't pick up enough boost. Stuck in the goal for too long. Yuki has got boost bug here. Could, yeah, could yeah. have been up there. Could have been up that's, there. That's a, that's a boost bug. This. He's using a lot of boost yeah. here, but it's, it's a replay he bug. Probably he probably thought uh, Scrub had enough boost. Yeah, had true. Enough. I wonder, we could actually check if these guys are using comps. Do you reckon they're in Ryan's Discord? Nah. Uh, nah Scrub's scrub in Ryan's Discord. Ryan. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Scrub's in Ryan's Discord. So Ryan, no doubt, is just trolling Scrub. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. and there's the tilt coming in. He's nervous. Yeah. So Ryan must be yelling things in Scrub's ear. Miss there. Well from done the young, with that. That's a difficult from, word. From the young Scotsman. Yeah. If anybody is gonna think of being harsh there, that is a that's a joke. So saved by Yukio. This has been such one-sided oh. pressure for the past minute. Bumping. Almost got him. Fairy Peak such a presence in any two v two lobby. You've had you were battling with them for rank one last season. Yeah. What's it like playing against Fairy? Um, it's just. He's just very smart. Everything he does, he has a purpose. He knows what to do. He just scars. <laughs> he so rarely looks at a position. He's like, yeah. YOLO. You know, he's always just like, how yeah. can I not screw this up? And Basically, then he doesn't yeah. screw it up. I, the only thing I think I, you can do against him is bump him. Because that is just... And then he's in a Batmobile, yeah, so even that's hard. True. Although you, you can bump Batmobiles. So Jesse, how long do you stay? Can we expect more duo streams like this? Uh, yeah, I think I stay until Monday. Until Monday, but yeah, well, you're leaving Monday. on Monday. Yeah, so, so we'll do duo streams every day till Monday. This is yeah. currently Thursday. So it's, uh, it's going to be full of content. And don't just look at my stream. Oh, here we go. Flame double touch on That's target. It. And Scrub it's in. Do not save it. Wow. Great speed by Flame here. The first touch is all he needed. There was no chance for the defense to react. You could have tried, and he wasn't too far off. Completely missed it. And then Scrub couldn't get it. I've got to say, that's a huge force error though like flame <laughs> you went at that so quickly i, I love the the the, the poggers just <laughs> looking at the other the direction backwards poggers, yeah, you like that yeah so, that's how i did it so, it's so funny some of them look <laughs> left some of them look right it's i love it funny, yeah. yeah that's how i did that email <laughs> i just thought it would be stupid right. so one nil to fairy and flame these guys are going to change team now we're going to get different teams oh, for red did two. you look at the saves yeah they were they got that cake up goal you then they were just on defense. and then just yeah. nine saves yeah so, Waiting it out. I like that. I like that. So they, we were talking about um, bumping. We were talking about fairy, or how do you bump Batmobiles? Because mm -hmm. a lot of people jump over it. Because when you're demoing an Octane, you can just dodge. The thing is, okay, what is really consistent with bumping Octane is you can jump and then boost down and then still catch them if they're on the ground and if they jump. But you can't do that with Batmobile because yeah. they still can. So if you jump yeah. and boost down, you can't bump them. You can bump them if they're, if they're just on the ground and you're on the ground. Or if they jump, you jump. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to save the last replay. My bad, boys. It was a good goal as well. Who do you think has taken this one? Let's have one in the chat for the Octanes, two for the Batmobiles. Ooh. Fairy and Scrub in the Batmobiles. Looking very blue. And I we've got Yukio was, Flame in the Octanes. The Batmobiles are just going to sit back and hope for mistakes, I think. That and was Scrub's playstyle last time. That is, yeah, that's Fairy Peak's playstyle too. That's why he's so good at twos. While he's playing with, you know, friends, he still wins so many games because he's yeah. just playing safe. Oh, Fairy Peak kid off at twos is, it's just disgusting. Yeah. You've played against that lineup, but yeah. it's just so horrible for the opponents. All right, Flame's got Scrub in a 1v1. Oh, oh here it is. Flip reset. Oh, I didn't get it. Scrub actually timed his challenge pretty well there. Even if the flip reset did land, it would have been hard to get it past Scrub. He moved forward, made himself really big. But also, I was going to say before that game, abruptly ended thanks to flames a million mile an hour double touch there yeah. will be dual streams well you know maybe uh, not as deliberate dual content uh, but we will have definitely me making cameo appearances at jesse stream for oh. the next few days so he's staying over huh you never invite me overhead <laughs> how dare you after all i've done for you worthless two timer listen who else will it be that thirsty poop have a nice life, you terrible, terrible person. <laughs> Listen, Brian. I hope Jesse leaves you for scum. 
Oh, Brian, you need to relax. That's a great setup by Fairy. Oh. I think Scrub is wise to turn around, though. Yuki was ready for it. Yeah. That's something you'll rarely see in he solo probably, queue. Yeah. Somebody turning around from an easy center ball like that. They think, oh, I could score this. They don't They don't stop to think, but wait, the goalie could also save it very easily. He, yeah, he had a, ooh, oh, that's a good save. Save by Flame. It's probably going to be a 50-50. Yeah, and a 50-50 with a goalkeeper as last yeah. man. No, a good idea. Scrub knew that. Decided not to go for it, even though it looked like a potentially easy finish. That well, pass That is was good, yeah. That's going to exactly be a goal every single time. That's exactly what they needed there. Yukio did Yukio kind of drop the ball it. here. Yeah, That's a that huge misplay. Yeah. You can't blame Flame it. in that should've, position. Yeah. Should have kept it. Should have dribbled it. Done something with it. So yeah, guys, be sure to follow twitch.tv forward slash Jesse if you haven't already. You're going to be streaming tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow British time. Afternoon, Probably one, earlier than one, you did this time. 1 p.m. 1 p.m. Yeah, like that, that seems a bit reasonable. So 1 p.m. UK two time, 2 p.m. Uh, European. Yeah, European. A normal stream time. Half the game gone. Fairy Peak looking to go up 2-0 again. He did this Ooh. last time that I did a 2's lobby on stream, which was just last week, actually. Or was it earlier? No, it was last week, I think. Um, Fairy Peak went two wins. Or he was 2-0 against Speed, Calyx, and Alex161. But then... In the final game, Speed and Alex161 managed to get a win over Calyx and Fairy Peak to make it a three-way tie for first. Wow. That's what happens in these lobbies. It's a three-way tie for first or a three-way tie for last place. Yeah. Where, with one person winning. But if you had to pick one person to win this at this point, surely everybody's going to say Fairy. Because he's looking like he's going to go 2-0. Yeah. I think that's being his, one win. his best uh, play. Oh, he, oh, he's, also, he's, he's so good, good at everything. everything. Yeah, he's good at everything. He's so good. Yeah, He's Fairy Peak, player. I think, if you include all playlists, is probably just the best player in the world. Yeah, If overall, you include ones, twos, threes, yeah, he's think, just the yeah. best right now. And he probably has been the best for a, a good while now. But Scrub's been climbing multiple playlists as well. He's taken rank one in solo standard uh, and 2v2 and 1v1 recently. Not all at the same time. Ooh. It's just taken Yukio to the cleaners here. And Yukio before we switch, we boost. already knew Yukio had no boost because he's hardly moving. Whoa, he did have boost. What is this? Nice. Nah, that's <laughs> fake, dude. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Replay bug. Um, yeah. Replay bug, Sionix, please. 3 nils. Grub and Fairy are proving Twitch chat right. You guys did all say 2 when I asked who was going to win. 2 was the Batmobile team. Got more uh, camera glitches here, but no problem for Scrub and Yukio because they don't see those. Those are just uh, spectator glitches. <laughs> so a very big fixed camera here. It's hilarious. You, you wonder if this is actually what he's playing like. We all know it isn't. Ooh, could have scored it. As with everything else in Rocket League, those dish plays off the backboard are all about the first touch. If you do it too high, mm. no longer scorable. Mm. Very big just find out. They're still looking so comfortable. Yeah. There, there's been almost be no goal. good chances for Yukio and Flame. Ooh, not the best pass. It was a relatively even game until Yukio's <coughs> bad clear. Yeah. And Scrub's immediate players. punish with the center ball. That's an interesting center ball. Notice how uh, Fairy decided to oh, hit that angle it. wall. Oh, this could be it. Ooh. Tried to dunk him. 27 seconds. Looks like we're going to go into game three with Fairy Peak winning 2 0 in the, the lobby. Scrub and Flame will be 1 1, and Yukio will be 0 2. Which probably just because there's no Gale Force Esports, well, formerly Gale Force Esports, now yeah. Team Dignitas players in the lobby. If there oh, were yeah, any of those guys in the lobby, Yukio's probably sweeping them 3 0. They, they won against, yeah, they keep winning against uh, Dignitas. See, if we, if we had a Turbo Kato or Panda in here, like Yukio would have no problem yeah. whatsoever, but as is. Hey, hold on. Oh, was struggling. I mean, 10 seconds. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to find someone here who doesn't have the camera glitch, but three oh. players had it there. That's a big dunk yeah. by Flame. Yeah. Fairy and Scrub being unnecessarily risky. A pass in end. defense. Don't like it. Like obviously, passing in defense. This is a good can chance. Work. This could be it. Still, Still could options. Be it. Top oh, corner shot by Flame. Wow. Went for Hold the shot. Up. He could have done so much. That's a very good decision. Wow. Like We're talking about game three. Flame is not done. Wow. Look at that finish. That needed to be top corner. He went for it. There was he could have just but he, he knew he was gonna score that. Wow. Perfect placement. 
some would say the best player in the Rocket League rival series at the moment, but it's not over yet. This is still regulation time. Ball still in the air. Fairy Peak and Scrub looking for the win in regulation time. It's going to go OT, though. Scripted, as always. Wow. The 3-3. Three, three, I can't. We were talking about how, how it, Fairy It should have been. It no should have been game. Scrub and Fairy went for a passing play. Yeah. With 15 seconds left in a two-goal lead. What were they thinking? I don't know. They're definitely regretting that now because they're not just in a tie game situation. They're under pressure here. That's a bit of a misplay there by Yuki. He let Scrub pick up that mid boost. That's probably going to starve him momentarily. He's saving up his boost quite well, though. There it is. Let the boost bump him. No. Flame is waiting for his opportunity. He waited so patiently in the in regulation time. This is a 2v1. This is a 1v2 if they're fast, yeah. Scrub realized that he was out of the game. Went straight for the ball. Ball chasing was the correct play there. Fairy Peak did not want to step forward as last man. Mm -hmm. Flame is playing so defensive right now. He's always waiting for a 50-50 to go badly. That's the center ball to Fairy Peak. Both Scrubs cut in front of him. That Yukio be, saves. Be a good counter. I think there might be starved. Yeah, Yukio This is starved. very much a Yukio versus Scrub battle in the midfield with Fairy Peak and Flame sitting back. They're trying that passing play again. It's so risky to go for an infield pass in 2v2. It's a big chance, though. Scrub is up. Oh, great save. Flame great has been counter. insane. Taking so more risks right now. Absolutely insane to come back and make this a tie game. Remember, this is the same man who yeah, he, won he game won one with a sick one. double touch. Yeah. We're yeah, talking about Scrub and Fairy. He's a really good twos player. He's shining a lot lately. He's just been really he's elevating been really his play. Really good lately. It's a shame that he won't, we won't see him in RLCS. Yeah. Season seven or six, rather. Yeah, I thought they were the most secure to have it, and they didn't get they it. They were just a couple of seconds away from qualifying before Servette equalized on them. You deal with it, with there. He has been the most nervous player in this lobby. It's no yeah. question about that. He's still playing very fast. He's not hesitating, and that's uh, <laughs> that's good to see. When players start to play worse than they're used to playing, sometimes the hesitation creeps in. Yeah, start to play going slowly. For it. Yukio is not hesitating at all. This could be a really good chance. Thinks about boost. <laughs> oh dear, Yukio, yeah, where is he going? Misread there. He could have gone for the boost seal, which would have yeah. been much safer. This is wide open and for open Yukio. And he he puts it in. And it's Flame, who's going to be 2 0. Yeah. After Fairy and Scrub, Damn. we're leading by three. That one double commit is all it took for Flame I and Yukio. I can't Yukio believe to get they lead. lost it. That's so crazy. Now Scrub is 2 0 down. Scrub zero? zero two. Scrub is on zero after two games. Can yeah. you believe it? Yukio gets one to his name. Flame gets two. And we go into the final game. Uh, so I don't want to forget what that replay is. Jam, 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 jam. I, I never heard that noise before <laughs> in my life. Thanks, Brian. Fairy right. Peak and has Yukio. a chance to completely humiliate Scrub. They could get, there's wow. two options here. We're gonna have a three-way tie between Yukio, Fairy Peak, and Flame for two wins and one loss. Or Flame wins the lobby outright. This man has been the MVP for me so far. Flame, yeah, he's been playing really well. Like he clutched, every, yeah, clutched he the clutched equalizer everything. last game and he clutched the win in, the, in game yeah. one. And not only that, he had a pre-jump save in game two as well, which both, had both of us complimenting him. Did you change the title, by the way? Did nah, one of my, my, hopefully one of my mods said it. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I literally never change the title except when I'm going live. Uh. Five, C5 Magics in chat is usually very, very helpful with that sort of thing. Now, are we going to see more of Fairy Peak just sitting back waiting? They actually did get a lot of chances last game. The they were three goals up. Yeah. Not sure what happened. The thing I've noticed is that Flame and Fairy Peak are the two players who are most inclined to stay back and avoid moving forward, like cheating mm -hmm. mid-game. So obviously you can cheat on kickoffs. I'm like a firm yeah. believer in cheating at any stage of the game. You could like just hope that a 50-50 goes well. It did take them long forward. to score the first game. Yeah. Finally got it. Won Flame was waiting back. They were, they were down by three and he just kept on biding his time, biding his time. Eventually the opportunity started coming and they got the comeback. Oh, it's a 1v2. Do you he got the 50 oh, wow, that's oh. very good 50-50s. Do you think that 2v2 has more comeback potential than 1v1? Or than a 3v3, rather? Uh, yeah, and 3v3, for sure. 3v3 
when you're uh, ahead I mean, by three or especially four. Um, kickoff goals can happen yeah, a kickoff lot goals. in uh, two v two, and in three v three, it barely Never happens. happens. Yeah. yeah. Which, you know, it it's a good thing in a way, but also it does mean that when you're losing by 3 or 4 in, in 3v3, it's like, it's over. But I've seen a yeah. fair amount of comebacks from 3 or 4 goals in 2v2. Yeah. Quite a few. It's much more likely to happen. Yeah, I think it's more consistent. Um, the better team wins in 3s than in 2s. Yeah. 2s, man, some oh, stuff wow. can happen. That's just that a That is goal. just wide open. Flame. Not Looking sure what for happened. boost to the side of the field instead of going back to goal. He's just dodged Ooh. off to the side and he turns the wrong to way. Be fair, yeah, he turned the wrong way. Scrub gave it perfectly away for Fairy Peak. Then was probably expecting something more. There. It's a big oh. win by Scrub again. Yukio. Oh, middle. Looking second oh. to the ball. That's on target. Fairy Peak again from distance. That's why you can't give Fairy Peak any time on the ball. So fast to turn around and shoot that. That's really very wow, quick. Yeah, that was really fast. Very quick on the turn. You notice how few times Fairy Peak had to steer there. He just turned once and he's already in the right position. He didn't yeah. turn and then turn again and then turn again. He's just he in the one right goal, line. One and he turn. went for it. Just straight away. He, he knew exactly what was going to happen. Again, Yukio can't be faulted for his speed. He's playing with zero hesitation still. Fairy oh, Peak is looking to follow up on a rebound here. That Flame has missed yes, it. And it Fairy is. Peak, three goals. They're looking just as comfortable this game as they did last. I mean, half game is still left, so anything can happen, especially in 2v2. Oh, I mean, we saw a 3-0 come I mean, back in 20 seconds last look, game. Anything can happen. this is the perfect happen. situation. Flip reset, boom, goal. Okay. What happened? Okay. Where, where's the flip reset? I mean, he could get it. I mean, <laughs> there's a chance he You've gets it. You've been watching it. a little bit too much of Ample, too. <laughs> yeah, that guy is pretty nuts. Oh, my God. Scrub trying to sneak a shot in from close range. Very good save. Fairy Peak is absolutely dominating oh, this game, by the way. That first touch is just too good from Fairy. He doesn't even need to score this quickly. But if somebody was anywhere near him, they would probably still not be saving it. Because he's so quick to recycle with positioning. From Fairy, on point. Shout out to Yuki. He had a big part to play in that play. Not only did he sweep up defensively, but he also did find Fairy Peak at the Whoa, edge of the box. This might, this so that should be goal. This really should be. That's one of the positions where you expect Fairy to be most dangerous. Unfortunate man. It's never never for Scrub and Flame. Scrub looking for a near post double touch, no luck. Still plenty of time on the clock, but it is looking dire for Scrub Killer. He is currently 0 and 2. He must be feeling robbed though. Oh he was my. winning 3 0 with so long left, and then it was actually a careless passing play with 15 seconds remaining that started the comeback for Flame and yeah. Yuki on the last game. There was absolutely no reason for Fairy and Scrub to go for oh, that. Oh, that could be a goal. It is. Good shot by Flame. All right. I mean, it's still open. Flame got how many comebacks now? Yeah, Flame is the comeback king. Two. He's still trying to win this lobby outright. And what a, what a lobby to win versus. Yeah. Yukio, All the, the world champion Slayer, Fairy Peak, maybe the best player in the world. All playoffs cons or all playlists considered, and Scrub, the two-time 12 Titans champion. This is a pretty good lobby for Flame to to sweep if yeah. he's able to do it. He did manage to get a lot of the variable bump, the goals. The bump, there it is. Oh, I didn't get it. It's like that would that would have been a goal. It would have. Scrub was not in position. Eh, maybe. Fairy Peak has just scored wow. his fifth goal of the lobby. That is carrying from the bottom wow. from Yukio. Yeah, Yukio. Seen it. Yukio carrying just from moral the bottom support. there. He's right there just cheering on uh, Fairy Peak trying to put that in. I really think Flame expected the shot to go across the goal there because of the way that Fairy Peak lined up the shot. Mm -hmm. He made a run up from the right hand side of the ball but swung by it on the, on the outside. Puts it straight back into the there near post. another goal. Still three goals in it. Oh, Flame doesn't Come have much boost, but he this. needs to put it in. And he will. Highest goals. scoring game here that we see. How many goals does Flame have? Flame, Flame right now, I think goals. he scored yeah, yeah. two goals. It's a bit more of an even wow. distribution of points on the. Uh, he doesn't even have a shot. <laughs> let's Fairy Peak do everything. Oh my like goodness, that. Fairy Peak flip reset on the ceiling. Oh. Doesn't even need it. He scored a double hat trick inside five minutes. It's just efficiency. Yeah. It's, that's that's all I can say when I watch these goals by Fairy Peak. He's just brutally efficient. 
And he's I like the way he goes for the boost. He, he yeah, he kind of missed that one, but <laughs> he he was looking to get three boost pads. Yeah, yeah. it's like a si not a direct cheat. He's uh, doing a boost yeah. grab cheat where you do a little circle around the outside. Well, not the outside lane, but the yeah. inside lane of the field. If the ball does go to the the right side, you, I guess you could um, if you play with a duo, you could you know manipulate the ball to yeah, make sure that it goes side. that side. Yeah, we good. It does, y when you arrive in the other team's half, or when you get to the halfway line, you have 70 or so boost when you do that line. That yeah. cheat line that Fairy Peak's doing, so it's pretty useful. That surely now game. I mean, we called game two too early. I mean, Not making the game. same mistake this again this time. This is just game. Oh, you go his first shot on target? Nah. Oh, he, oh, he got it. a shot he for that. That's it. generous. No, I, don't, I don't think he got it for that one. But. Well, all I know is Fairy Peak Brazil, Yukio, wow. and shots. And Scrub Killer just got swept. Very unfortunate. <laughs> it was Scotsman. It was definitely. It was very unfortunate. He uh, he was winning game two with about yeah. thirty seconds left. They were winning by two goals with fifteen seconds left, and they had the ball and full boost on both members of the team, and they threw it away. So huge mistake. But what a carry by Fairy Peak. That is that was uh, that is astonishing. Six goals, seven hey shots. Every every Michael shot. Here. John, the first Put have a free target. content idea. You to do that when get you're trying to get to rank one, one in two v two. You need to take all the games. Play with Yukio. You <laughs> decide what cars they <laughs> use for some thinking. Um, I mean, Fairy Peaks rank one in two v two for a reason. He wins the games where he's carrying, but he also wins the games where he's yeah. Yeah. carrying from the bottom. Yeah, like so he he's just so consistent. <laughs> Yukio, carry Peak. <laughs> Oh, uh, Yuki, remember, you can't use like, the, both of the poggers, though.